Let's make some built-in benches in the kitchen. We're going to fill up this corner so they have a place to sit and a place to store stuff. These simple benches have a lift up top, room underneath, and I decided to build them in place and so I made the frames out of 2x3s. These are about 18 inches by 18 inches. These aren't going to be seen and 2x3s are strong, easy to work with and very inexpensive. So there's the frame. I made three of these and that was enough because the rest of the frame I could attach to the walls. And you see I just pre-drilled them like this and then I had to cut out a piece of the baseboard so I could fit the frame in there up against the wall and leave enough space for my three-quarter inch plywood that I'd be putting on the face. These got screwed down to the floor and to the wall and there is the framing in place. Very sturdy and now I just have to cut the plywood skin that's going to go over it. I just did this in the client's backyard which is usually how I work. So with the plywood cut, I got the nail gun out, nailed the plywood there and I've got these corners here that didn't all match up perfectly so I just ripped pieces of nice 1x4 pine to glue and nail into the end because I knew I wasn't going to have a perfect corner so that was my plan. I had to move that electrical so they could have access to it so I just put it in the side of the box there. So now with my plywood on I cut the top for the bench got a hole in there and I'm going to use a piano hinge and I wanted it to match the edge of that counter there so I just got this uh, door casing and just put it on the side there again with the nail gun just gives it a nice finish and hides the edges since this was paint grade I could patch all the nail holes and dings and just caulk along the edge of the wall and using that tape there gives you a nice even bead of caulk. So I got to get the door evenly spaced. Had to trim that a little bit. And with my piano hinge in place, the door moves up and down. And as you can see, it rests on that 2x3 frame, so it's sturdy. Now I give everything a light sanding and then wipe it down with acetone to clean it up applied a coat of primer and then applied a finish coat of uh, semi-gloss paint and then got some oak quarter round to match what was existing in the other areas of the kitchen and it matches the floor. It's a nice touch, brings it all together and the final screw into the piano hinge and look at that. You've got a lift up top storage underneath your bench and just turned a pretty unusable small corner of the kitchen into a nice nook. They put some cushions on there, set up a round table, they got a great breakfast nook. Not too hard to do. Thanks for watching.